I want to be upfront with you. This is not my voice. It's a computer-generated voice I selected completely because there was simply not a podunk backwards assed hillbilly dialect. And the lady voice is kinda sexy. I assume you have enough sense in your noggin to get out of the friggin' rain. If not you're either a godless commie, or a snot gobbling pansy assed snowflake. So if you ain't got the sense then shut this some bitch off now. If you're still here, you know our country, hell the whole damn planet, is in a world of hurt. The fancy pants globalist bastitches are violating our fargan rights. They aim to kill most of us and make slaves of the rest. Americans have in our DNA, specific coding to live free. But, lately, I've seen plenty of folks, them knee-bending disrespectful efforts, them some bitches don't share our American sensibilities. So, the godless commie fancy pants globalists, have pitted the candy ass snowflakes against us god-fearing Americans. They'd like us to have a little civil war. Should be done by lunch. But who wants to kill sissies? Smart folks figure, we should hug sissies and get them whiny effers on our side and go after the real problem. Which is, them godless commie fancy pants globalist bastards. To get them fug and bass stitches, we need to start in our own backyard. We need to eliminate, and I mean annihilate, our weak cast, demonic, elected leaders, that the godless commie fancy pants bastards have bribed, with our damn money. Since them godless, commie, bastards, have upset them candy ass snowflakes, by tricking them into filling their bodies with satanic ungodly substances, also known as vaccines. I figure we can get them to whine and bitch to the government. It's their God-given right for Pete's sake. And they're actually good at it. Crying, and whining, and just pretty much being miserable and disdainful. God made that's not gobbling. Candy asses just for shit like this. while they're frolicking about, in their pussy hats, airing their grievances to the feckless government. We God-fearing Americans can keep our powder dry, and lay in wait to see what the godless commie bastards do next. If the godless commie bastards decide to roll up in here in, let's say UN vehicles, we can unload God's fury on their asses. We can put a Judy chop, or smear other means of medieval ferocity on their fancy pants asses. Or maybe, they'll send the godless commie Chinese bastitches in, to put some hurt on us, but we can counter with all kinds of ordnance and whatnot. It'd be a colossal fuss to cluck and they'd want out most rinky dink. No matter what they do, no matter how they strike, we gotta stay strong and resolved. We gotta let them effers know if they want a piece of our ass. They're gonna need to pack a friggin' lunch, cause there ain't no cherry here. Gotten as far as them knee bending, America hating, flag burning, cowards go. If you ain't smart enough to understand the difference between your country and its government, then we'll put a country ass whooping on them too.